Greg, me and my good friend Jody. Hi, how are you? Not bad. This is my friend Greg, this is his boat. And we're going to go fishing not, for lunch. Yeah, not the boat you were expecting, but it works for us, right, Greg? <laughs> <laughs> All the sandals properties here in Jamaica? Sure, yeah, yeah, Ma which many one, times. Which one is your favorite? It's like asking me to pick my favorite child. That's, pick your favorite on the sickest day. Yeah, I like Sandals White House. Oh yeah? I like the seclusion of it. Um, you know, it's in a nature reserve on the south coast, which is more or less untouched. Yeah. I love the drive there. They've just done the road up, so the road's nice and smooth. The beach is beautiful. You've got, you know, the Pelican Bar nearby, and, you know, Middle Quarters is close by for pepper shrimp. I love it down there. I think it's really nice. Do you use Waze a lot in your Google Maps? Listen, <laughs> I've, been to, I've been to all 14 parishes. You don't get lost? No. No, actually, I, I made a conscious effort to go out and just see the four corners. There's some places, you know, listen, I'm not going to St. Thomas every weekend because it's a complete opposite end of the country. Yeah. And some places I know better, but I, I have made a conscious effort, you know, actually to go and see where I'm living. Yeah. Um, and it, it's great. There's just so many hidden gems. And, <laughs> and you love our food? Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly, exactly. I mean, not, not just jerk, but you know, fr nice fried fish and uh, I love oxtail, curry goat. These are things that, you know, probably 10 years ago I would, I would have run a mile from, but yeah. now, you know, I, I like cook too. I cook a, I cook, a, cook a good oxtail. You do? Yeah. Okay, better than me. I can't cook oxtail, yeah, but yeah. I can eat it. <laughs> I read between those lines. I actually went out and bought my pressure cooker and... <laughs> really? Yeah. Okay. Well, I need to chase your hand <laughs> because I, I cannot cook oxtail. Whenever you're ready. So can't have the guy from England come to Jamaica and cook a really good oxtail. <laughs> okay, so other than going to the yacht club, where do you unwind and what do you do? I spend a lot of time between Montego Bay and Kingston, which is great. I mean, it's a relatively unique position because it means I can tap in and out or go on the hustle and bustle of Kingston. That I'm a city boy at heart, um, but equally, I love the space of Montego Bay. So I'll, it really depends what I'm looking for. If I want to go out and hit a nightclub or go, go for a restaurant with friends, then I'll go to Kingston, you know, and Montego Bay if I just want to just unwind. I mean, there's nowhere better. Now you've been in Jamaica for three years? Three and a half years, yeah. Three and a half years. Do you have, you know, someone special that you'd like to take out on the boat with you every now and then? <laughs> well, apart from Greg, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I have a girlfriend. Is she Jamaican? She is, yeah. So Jamaican's finest. Leave. Yeah, you'll never leave. <laughs> no, 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 it would be difficult to. Now we've been dating for about 10 months. We met at a party in Portland uh, and didn't see her for a year and then, and then um, sort of met a year, literally a, a year later. Um, and then that's where it happened. Actually, I, actually, I ended up trying to get her telephone number for a friend of mine. Yeah, okay, that, that old, ch that old chestnut, right so yeah. yeah. Okay, Greg. Yeah. I noticed you stopped the boat. Is this where we're fishing? It is. Unfortunately, it's really windy today. So what we'll do is just stick around the bay. And uh, we have a little spot called the strike zone. <laughs> Steven knows about the strike zone. Yeah. yeah. Uh, so yeah, we'll stick around here. It's way too rough offshore. And we'll see if we can catch some fish. Sushi. Yeah, sushi, sushi me up. <laughs> I never catch anything. And I literally never catch anything. I'm hoping with your luck, we're, we're, we're going to we're we're catch get dinner. dinner. <laughs> Otherwise, we're going to go back to the yacht club and eat there. Okay. Ready? Ready.
fishing was a bus, but that's okay because we can just go and buy fish <laughs> at the Seahorse Bar and Grill. So let's go, let's go get some fish. Day today. We didn't catch any fish. Zero. But we did get some amazing fajitas here and jerk conch. You know I'm gonna have a little bit of, of course. Right? Okay. But thank you so much. My pleasure. Thank you for coming. So awesome. Your chill spot here at the Seahorse Bar and Grill. I'll definitely be back. It was great being on the ocean. I, and the fishing thing, we'll have to do, try that <laughs> yeah. again another time. It's a time. work in progress. Yeah. We'll have to try that again another time. But thank you so much. My pleasure. Really Thanks for coming. Day. Thank you. it for this week's chill spot. I had a great day at the Seahorse Bar and Grill in Montego Bay, hanging out with the Global Director of Public Relations for Sandals Group, Stephen Hector. See you next week. We're heading to the Seahorse Bar and Grill. Jump in. Boom, boom. <laughs> so, wish me a safe drive. Oh, put Cadbury to pedal. And watch the eyes. <laughs> Flowers are bloom. <laughs> Hi, I'm Jody, and this week on I was gonna make up a name for the show. Stay tuned, we'll be more with more back after. <laughs>